Diabetes is a big job, but there is no one I can hire to do this for me. You can't post an ad on Craigslist and expect somebody else to do this. It is my job, it is your job. We're the only ones that can take care of our diabetes. We're the only ones. No one can make me check my blood sugar and make me count carbs and take shots. It's all up to me. We can do this because there's no level of perfection that matters. Whatever is the best you can do is all that's expected of you. Some days my best is like right on target. Some years my best is like I can focus on my diet, I can make sure I get lots of exercise every day, and everything's fine-tuned, my insulin, my carbs, blah, blah, blah. Other days, other years, my best is different, you know? It's just different. And you know, if you know me at all from the DOC, you know that I love to exercise, I loved powerlifting and yoga, and I say loved in the past tense because right now I'm injured and I can't do the stuff I love. My passion for my health has really kind of, because I can't do the things that I love to do when it comes to my health. So that means that my best in my health right now is not the same as my best in my health was a year ago. A year ago, I could do anything. I could lift a few hundred pounds off the floor. I could do back bends and handstands and headstands. And now I can't do that stuff. I mean, I can, but it hurts a lot. Being injured sucks. I've been doing all this gentle exercise. Do you know how I feel about gentle exercise? It's not really my thing. So life is different, and that means that my diabetes management is different. It means I'm different. Do I still check my blood sugar all the time? Yes. Do I take shots and count carbs? Yes. My A1C is actually exactly the same as it was a year ago when I was crazy active every day. You know, for me right now, my health, my diabetes is about being patient. It's patience. Which is, you know, not really a forte of mine, usually. As my dad always says, you gotta adapt, improvise, and eventually overcome. A-I-O, he says. A-I-O. My dad loves that phrase. A-I-O. Hey, I'm not perfect. If I can do it, you can do it. You can do this, because all you have to do is your best. That doesn't mean perfection. That doesn't mean what your doctor wants or what your mom and your dad or your sister or your boyfriend want. It's what you today, right now, are capable of. Oh, you can do this. I know that you can. I just hope you know too.